Where are we? We're on problem number two now. And, you know, certainly we, we went through the work and we came up with a really nice answer to it. And what I want to do is I want to use Sage to do it. What am I doing? Going back to the original problem, I'm going to integrate. What am I going to integrate? The sine of 3x, and that's 3 star x, by the way. You can't put 3x down. Divide it by the sine of x with respect to x. Let's see what happens. What does it give me? It gives me x plus sine of 2x, which is if we have that answer. And I do see that answer, by the way. And certainly, as soon as it's a different order, it's really the same thing. It's sine of 2x plus x. The only thing that's missing is a constant, all right? Now, again, <coughs> when, I, when I put the code down here, this is code that you can easily copy-paste if you want. More importantly, I want to point out that when I'm using um, this um, software, I can actually integrate it with LaTeX, and that's what SageTech is, an integration between Sage and LaTeX. And it's actually outputting uh, what I expect to see, which is x plus the sine of 2x plus c. Thank you.